Hey everyone, Dion here with the Turquoise Iris, and we're on day 20 of 28 lives in 28 days, which means I only have eight more days to you can't see me alive every day. Who's going to be happy about that? <laughs> I don't know. I get kind of, I, I may not be happy about it actually. Hi Amber. Um, so anyway, you guys, as your pop on here, let me know. I see that Amber's here. Um, hi Q. I got out in the garage. It's sleeting. Sleeting and it's packing on the roofs and everything. I swear I woke up to 65 degrees this morning and then whoosh, it is sleeting. Margie, is it sleeting where you are too? Now I have a super excuse not to do laundry. Yes, Amber! Have a seat. Take a break. Take a load off. Literally. Take a load off of that laundry. Ha! Huh? Hi, Jennifer! You guys and so I'm working on this it's actually nice and toasty in the garage I got it warmed up it's been warming all morning at 73 I'm gonna tell you we had a little ice storm come in I went to class or uh, to the gym I came out and there's ice all over my car what I didn't even know it was gonna happen yes it's icy where Margie is Margie thank you so much for my gifts I have my little pillow let me show you all this Q I gotta get this done I gotta get this done that's why. Um, I gotta show y'all something. And yes, these two things. So I have a class, right? And people bring me gifts. Is that the nicest thing? I got a necklace. Um, I got gift cards. Um, yes, you left Oklahoma City just in time. You are so right. Um, I got gifts from my class the other night. And, um, yeah, I got a Hobby Lobby gift card. Oh, 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 oh. Right. Um, but then Miss Margie brought me this. Look. Can you read it? I poop magic. Fantastic. It's a unicorn. Poops magic. And she gave me this little pillow. Look at that. Isn't that cute? And then she gave me this. whimsical. I am so blessed. Like, people are so thoughtful. Absolutely thoughtful. And then Margie brought me also, and Kawita. She brought me and Kawita something. She bought me um, the Monet hair products, the shampoo and conditioners. Loaded me up with a cosmetic bag. And so, uh, yep, I was just going through all my gifts. So I got to get that shampoo out and give it a shot. Um, so, yeah. Okay, here's what we're doing. This is the piece from my online class three weeks ago. I'm not done. It's the only piece I haven't finished. And so I'm going out of town on Thursday and I want to get this done. So I have all of this and it's time to add our kissing booth. You guys, this is all DIY. Um, I have my next, right. Um, I have my next online class March 3rd, and I have the piece over here that I'm going to be working on during the class. So tickets are available right now. Um, it's a live interactive class, and we can have as many as we want, right? Because it's all online. I put you in a little Facebook group, and we work, we paint at the same time, or you can sit back, and you can just enjoy and watch for like up to two weeks at your own leisure. Um, I haven't even finished this piece, and this was the one. So look, the front's finished. I think I've showed you guys like 80 times. But I have this one side left. So I'm going to add the pink. And then I'll get some wax on it. And we'll be done. Let's talk about the online class. Is it a start to finish class? Yes, Amber. I've got a piece over here. I've got a piece right here. Right here. Let's talk about it. Right here. See this guy right here? I'm gonna paint that start to finish in my class. Now, we do take breaks, or we will take a break. I will have someone helping me. My sister-in-law is going to man the laptop and answer your questions. So occasionally we'll stop, we'll answer questions, um, but I'm gonna start with um, layering the paint colors. I'm gonna do Bohemian Blue, Old 57, Marquee Red, and Queen B, you do not have to use those colors. You do not have to paint at all. You can just sit back and watch and then use um, 
Wonderland is where I live. Margie, that is priceless. Hi, Shay. Um, my sister-in-law is on here now. But no, you can use, you can watch the class whenever, and I leave you in the group for like two weeks. And um, you, some of the ladies, what the people have been doing last time, I should say ladies and gentlemen, um, we had, Brian was in the class last time, and I think he's in this one too. During the class, the ladies would say, hey, can you look at this? And I would pull them up on the broadcast and I'd look at the piece of furniture that they're working on. Um, and then questions. I think we were able to pull up like five or six people. So it was so fun. And we just did it on a Saturday afternoon. Um, like I said, you don't have to be present. If something comes up, it's just your ear. They're in the group. And then like the, if, you, if you join this class this time, you actually get to go back and watch the first class because I have not deleted that video. It's still there. So if you pay for this ticket this time, um, you actually get to go back and watch the first class too while you're waiting for the second class. And this is the link for that online class right now. So let's just get this pink on, pink on real quick. I don't know why it just posted twice. Great time had by all. Thank you, Margie. She's so good to me. So good to me. You guys, we still have, if you're a retailer to DIY paint, we still have a few spots left for boot camp. If you're a retailer and you, you're new and you haven't gone before, let me make sure I do this right. Whoa, I didn't use Queen Bee. Did I? No, I used Cowgirl Coral. What a dummy, hang tight. About threw the wrong color up on there today. Just about did. Hi, Shelly. Actually, I did use the kissing booth, but very little. This. <laughs> oh, thank you, Jennifer. Look at me, what a dummy. What a dummy. I just about got myself into trouble putting the wrong color on there. Let me get this stirred up, you guys. I'm looking right at it and calling it a different color and grabbing. Shout out to LaDawn. I tried out my sprayer that my husband grabbed from me from Hobby Lobby when I was in class. Boom! Cindy, you're sitting in class and you sent your husband to Hobby Lobby. That's a good man. 20 hours. Did you get your barbecue? Cindy, did you get your barbecue when you were in um, uh, Kansas City? That's where you were going to stop. See how we just pulled that color right over the others? And as I'm doing it, I'm scraping and letting some of that yellow come through as well. Yes, he loved the barbecue in Kansas. Oh, good. That was, the, that was worth the 40 hours on the road coming to my class. What a good man. Oh. So this is a little watered down. And I dripped it. Look at that splat right there. We're about to, you know what we're about to do, don't you? Spray it. So I've got a few minutes before I've got to go pick up six 12-year-olds. Of course, most of them are 13, except my little young baby. Got that coming up. And it is still sleeting. I mean, sleeting. Heavy. Yo, can, can you hear it on my window? Hi, Sherry. It's hitting my windows. Ah! We woke up to 65, and now we have 30. Baseball's canceled, all the good stuff. You guys, I met Q yesterday for lunch and Carly before she headed out of town. We ate at this wonderful little Italian place I'd never even been to. It was on, in Norman on Campus Corner, right at OU. I'd never even been there before. Called Victoria's. Oh my gosh, I love how this looks, you guys. Take a peek. Come down. Come down, take a peek. Look right here. How that yellow's coming through right there. Ugh. You know what I think I need? 
I hate to get rid of this, but maybe I just need to clean it. Quita says you just take your electric sander and get all this paint off. I'm not good at cleaning my tools. <sighs> oh, Shelly, it's there too. Oh, I hate it. It was so nice this morning. I mean, it was chilly, but then wham. I love it over the bohemian blue. So right now I put the base coat on and then I put the layering on and now I'm adding some highlights. And I'm just re-wetting it to reactivate the paint colors and I'm just kind of blending and distressing a little bit. Just thought you guys might want to join me. Like I said, I've had my heaters on all day out here and it's pretty toasty actually. I may have to take my jacket off. has any questions about that online class let me know amber asked her question and then i've got tickets available for the next class at reclaim warehouse too we sold about 10 or 12 i think but we've got 35 total so we've sold 10 so i may have 25 to 23 spots left hi tucson junkers Somebody said something about, oh, Michelle's coming. Yep, Michelle was out of my last class. Michelle's gonna come again. You guys are so awesome. So awesome. Oh, I'm just loving it. I'm gonna put a little bit more of the cowgirl coral down here. Hi, Twyla. I'm gonna to get to the kissing booth. I totally jumped way ahead of myself earlier. Put just a little bit down here. Well, that came out a lot more than just a little bit. You see that? I said a little bit. Jeez. You better get us some water. We better get us some water. Here we go. Now we're moving it. Now we're going. Love it. Here we go. You guys, I know this style is maybe for everybody, but it sure is fun. Because when I make a booboo, -boo, I don't have to panic. Thank you, Twyla. Perfect. Awesome, Lisa. I don't have to panic, and I like not being able to panic. I don't have to, because I can fix it. It's just paint. Or if I end up distressing a little bit more than I planned, so what? I distressed a little more than I planned. No worries. No worries. Be happy, no worries, right? All right. So once this dries, I'll be adding a clear and a little bit of dark wax, and then it will look more like the front. And um, I'm gonna get this baby photographed and hopefully get her up for sale tomorrow. Um, got the Mexican doors that I've been working on. Those are delivered, or actually they came and picked them up. So I'm gonna, Miss Tracy loved those. It made me very happy. Panic-free painting, Lisa. That's right. Come on up here this way. Whoops, wrong way. Thank you for who just shared that. I think that was Michelle. Thank you. So up here I have mint chip. Old 57 and then I have sea glass. 
Down here I had Hey Sailor and um, Bohemia Blue because you can't do anything without Boho Blue. Um, I know that's not a very good angle, but it's the best I can do right now. I heard a lot in the class the other night that watching it live on here on your phone is so much different, hi Chandra, than in person. But like it's so much different. Of course, I don't, I don't see that. I don't realize it is, but that was kind of fun to hear, the feedback from the class. So one of my classes coming up, we're going to do the Monet style dresser. Um, I'm going to show you guys how I do that. If you remember, there was a piece I did that we, I kind of nicknamed the Monet dresser, kind of how Monet has the water lilies. It was kind of ended up looking like that, and that wasn't my plan, but I'm going to show you guys how to do that in one of my upcoming classes. Probably we'll actually do it in a in-person class and a live class. It may be the March 24th class, now that I think about it. Oh, yes, I love when that happens. Good. I love that. Sometimes that works out and other times it doesn't. That worked out. Nobody let me forget those kids. I have no idea what time it is. Someone tell me the time. She said, hey, Athena, she said she's building a house, so when they're installed, she said she'd send me photos. I'm pretty pumped about it, really. I really, really am. Sorry, I'm not looking at your comments, ladies. I'm working on this while it's wet. I'm gonna move pretty quickly while it's wet. Grab a little bit of kissing booth. I said a little bit last time. We'll see what happens. Hi, Fatima. Hi, honey. Thanks for being here with me, you guys. I know it's a random Tuesday afternoon, but you know me. I like random, and I gotta, gotta do this before I go grab kiddos. We had a live in my group earlier where I interviewed, and um, one of the ladies in the group, I pulled her up live, and we practiced, and let her introduce herself, and those are always fun. I always love doing that. Anytime we can kind of help each other get more familiar with the internet and Facebook, it's always such a good thing. Because Lord knows I remember the first time I went live and then the first few after that. Woo! Craziness. So right now it's still bright, it's wet, but we're going to tone it down with a little bit of dark wax and clear wax. Um, and then we will get it to look like the front of this. I know it's dark, guys. It's very dark. I know you're not seeing this. But if you've been following me a while, then you know what this piece looks like anyway. Um, but anyway, if you have any more questions, 
post them in here. I'll try to get to you. But for now, have you ever thought about doing this on a whole wall? Yes. You know what I'm going to do? So do you see the supplies right here? I'm getting a new staging wall. My husband has um, got some plans and we are going to do the Dion on my staging wall. Yep, we are. So that's when I get back from being out of town. We are going to redo my wall, do the Dion, add some texture. I have like 50,000 holes in that wall and I'm, I, when I edit my pictures, I have to edit all those little dots. So I'm like, we gotta do something, I gotta start over. So we're doing the Dion but not in such bright colors. Now it won't be so bright and bold, but we are gonna do the Dion on my staging wall. I'm gonna do the Dion, he's gonna texture it, I should say. So yes, I'm glad you asked that. You seal your pieces with white wax? Um, sometimes. I love to use white, dark, black, clear, colored. Yep, absolutely. Um, but for right now, I've got to grab a bite to eat and go get those kiddos picked up and um, deliver from carpool. You guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I love your shares. If you have questions about the online class or the in-person class, holla. You know where to find me. Go to be awesome. Yay, Liesl. I hope you feel better, babe. You rest up.